I was attending the uh, ceremony that was being done to bless everybody. And during the course of it, I was standing off to the side. I can remember uh, turning to the gentleman next to me. I says, I think something just flew over us. But it was like something translucent. It lit up a little bit. And I remember looking at it and just saying how cool that was to experience something like that. Whatever powerful being it is, yeah, is like it's in, we called that night and as I don't told us his chin it and it went into war mode and hit itself, huh? Yeah. That's what it would that's what it would be like if it hit hits itself. The like when you're going when you go into a wartime state and you know you're being caught, you kind of go back into the shadows, you go back into the darkness, and you prepare yourself for battle. Right before the strike. Exactly. <laughs> Follow me, guys. Why? Where are you? Where are you taking us? Trying to go ahead and keep asking questions. Lion Do you need protection? Whoa! Dude, that was a cry! No, 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 no. That's like a bird. bird. Thunder being cried. Yeah, that's... <laughs> that's a Thunderbird cry. That was a cry of a Thunderbird, yeah. I've never heard that come through a, a SD7. Any technology. Any technology. What it's actually done was, again, get me to that point where I take that step back to evaluate and to, again, look at things and realize there are things that are coming that are going to be happening. The, uh, the, the shift is taking place. It's, it, again, across 
everything across the boards with everything things are changing and so many people are feeling it so many people uh are realizing it there, there's just things in play that are, that are happening that need to happen and it's just a, a a bizarre time but that's okay because we need we need some of that ancient knowledge to come back to the forefront and for some people to get grounded again we have to be careful with how we interact with each other and how we cohabitate with the world around us this includes the physical spiritual and all means of existence the thunderbird is an ancient beast one that is very powerful and one whose sighting is not something to be trifled with we as indigenous peoples have seen the sighting we as indigenous people are preparing Take care of yourself. And we would like to thank you for enjoying another episode of Unearthing the Supernatural. And join us next time for another episode of Unearthing the Supernatural.